Hey guys, welcome back to RC Tracks. Today is going to be update video <clears throat> number five. And sorry if I sound a little uh, muffled. I guess uh, I do have. It's kind of. It's not. I don't really have allergies, but in the mornings, uh, I'm usually a little bit. Uh, my throat is a bit sore, but then it gets better as the day goes on. So here we go. It's ridiculously messy. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's so messy. I've been working on my RCs. And what is this? Do any of you know what that is? It's my old combo and my slash 4x4. Huh. I, what do you suppose went into my new slash? Hmm. Let's go and take a look. Heavy. I weighed it today. It was seven pounds. So heavy. Sorry, it's a bit dusty, but uh, I was. That's how it is at the track. Pretty sweet, huh? All right. So enough quiet. Uh, now down to the details on this system. This is a Castle Creations. Uh, Censored uh, 3800 kV, uh, 1410. It's got a 5 mil shaft. It's a too big pinion gear. It's the only one I had just to test it out. But I'm gonna swap that out with like a 14 tooth. That's an 18. Over here we have the Sidewinder SCT Short Course Truck Edition. It's not hooked up via the sensor because this uh, ESC is not a sensored ESC. And then of course we got my Fly Sky and yeah. <clears throat> so that's my new combo. I got it for a hundred bucks on A main, which is a crazy deal, considering that this is an eighty-five dollar motor. So I literally got the ESC for like fifteen dollars. So it's a really good deal. Or I got the motor. This is like a fifty dollar ESC, so I got the motor for fifty bucks. So it's a real good deal. Um, even though it's not censored, it definitely feels like it's censored. It's just amazing. Uh, I love this Castle censored motor. It's there's no cogging. It, the lowest speed you can go in sensorless mode is a speed where, like, it's it's you can't go very slow in sensorless mode. But it won't if you barely press the throttle. It won't cog. It'll go like it. It won't. Yeah, it'll just move. Um, but yeah, this is pretty sweet. And con considering that, uh, since uh, when I got when I get the Mama Max Pro, uh, I didn't have enough money for that comp. If you had that, and I don't need a Mamba X where it has like, I don't need it to be waterproof and that sort of deal. Um, but once I get a Mama Max Pro for the motor to be censored, this thing can go in my Stampede because it's brushed right now, but I actually have a brushless motor on standby. It's right here. Taser motor. Taser. I, I, this is what was originally in the Stampede, though it's ESC broke. It's that ESC. Um, so this is the Taser motor, and uh, once I get a Mama Max Pro, then that ESC can hook up to the Taser motor and I'll have a brushless system. So that's kind of the deal I'm going for. Uh, let's see, what else? I got a new battery. I got another one. Another 30C reaction right there. I have four of them now. And then, whoops. I think I already showed you guys. These are my new outdoor tires, the Proline Gladiator SCs. They work pretty well. I haven't tested them out yet, but they are, they are, they are I know they're going to work pretty well on the outdoor track. And then these are my indoor tires and bashing tires because I ran it outside for a bit. Even though it's a track only truck, I really wanted to see how the motor handled and it was awesome. So I'll have to clean it up a bit. And yeah, that's kind of it for the slash. You also might be noticing, where's Boss Monster? Sold. Sold him to my neighbor. And yeah, that's going to be about it for this update video. Let me know in the comments uh, what you think this motor should go into the system. Thinking of buying a used two-wheel drive short course and this will fit perfect. That's going to be about it for this video. RC Tracks, signing out.